All right, guys, we're in the local Target today. We're gonna take a look over here while we're in the toys and look and see if they have any of the new Migos. If I can find what aisle they're on, I keep forgetting. Oh boy. And the Migos, they're kind of hit or miss, but I do like some of them. Let's take a look. got black series Star Wars stuff not my bag let's take a look on the other aisle it's a madhouse in here I think it's official I don't like shopping on the weekend they got just married with children that's it none of the new horror ones have hit yet apparently or they're just not here Marvel Legends fans there you go our toy section here at Target is a mess. Let's go take a look at the NECA and Pops. They got the Wellhouse Pennywise. Got this new Godzilla. Ooh, and a Predator I have not seen. This is the Jungle Predator, I believe. Now see, that might be a Predator worth picking up. I might pick this up. I feel like I should pick up something today. So we got that one there and they also have the uh, Los Angeles Predator that's pretty cool I don't have any Predators yet I'm digging those let's take a look at this Godzilla old school Godzilla here old school I don't know how much they are here there's no price by the Godzillas. So the Predator is definitely something interesting. They got a whole bunch of Gremlins. Let's see if they're all the same ones, I'm curious. Stripe, the regular Gremlin, which I think are the only two they'll have. Uh, so yeah, they got Stripes and the, uh, the original Gremlin. I'm trying to drop stuff here. So, Target's a win for new stuff. I'm definitely interested in that. I think I might get a Predator. Let's see if they got in Pops. Again, as I mentioned earlier in the video, not too hip on Pops right now. Just don't really care. There's nothing coming out uh, anytime soon. The Syrian. That's pretty cool. They want $25 one now. He's so small for $25. Just feel like it should be bigger. Alright, now that that's done. What's happening everybody out there YouTube land? I'm Vader Maz, and I'm coming back at you with another video. Today, we went on a pretty long hunt. We were out for a good few hours, but, uh, we didn't find anything till the last place we went to. Isn't that how it usually works? So, for all my viewers out there, how many of you guys, comment down below, how many of you guys uh, collect Funko Pops? Or uh, do you collect something else, like uh, NECA, Mezco, Hot Toys, uh, hell, books, movies? Uh, let me know down in the comments down below what you specifically collect. And if you collect any of those, what genre do you collect? I'd like to know what I'm working with. What would you guys actually like to collect? I'm thinking, as I focus primarily on horror myself, that I'll have a lot of viewers that are in that same boat. But, I could be wrong. So, without further ado, let's get into my haul for today. And it's not Funko Pops. I looked at them, but there just wasn't anything that I wanted to get yet. So, let's get into the first of it. We got a Predator. This is my first Predator figure. I have some Pops, but I don't have any NECA, Mezco, or Hot Toys or Sideshow Predators. This is my first Predator figure. And what better one to go with than the Jungle Predator from the first 
an original Predator movie with Arnold Schwarzenegger back in, uh, I think, the late 80s. Yeah, definitely late, late 80s. Mid to late 80s. So, here we have him in all his glory, the Predator. And we're going to crack this guy open here in a minute. But, fantastic figure. Now, I didn't stop there, though. I didn't just get one item. I got multiple items. We got the City Predator from the second Predator movie with uh, Danny Glover and Bill Paxton. Actually, I didn't hate this movie. I, I, I really kind of liked it. So, we got this second one here. It's probably all the Predators I'm going to end up buying. Um, I only like the first two original movies. The newest movie was kind of eh, but put your comments down below. What was your favorite Predator movie, or did you like the Alien vs. Predator? Um, of course, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna beat you guys up for liking something different than me, but these are the two that I liked the most, the ones that justified getting a figure. So with that being said, let's go to the uh, Jungle Predator and let's open this bad boy up. All right. So we got all the zip ties off of him. There he is in the packaging. See all the cool stuff he comes with. I'm gonna have a lot of fun trying to pose this guy. Ooh. Man. Now see that's really cool. His hair, his hair is not like all stiff or anything. That's really cool. He can move his hair around. But there he is with the broken hose and all. We'll have to glue that back in its place because the hose actually broke. Why would they even attach it there? Because now that I look at it, if you want to turn his arm up like it is right here, the hose doesn't work because the hose goes on this piece right here. So it limits his movement as it is. That doesn't make any sense. Let's put that hose underneath his arm and see how that works. There we go, guys. Jungle Predator. Jungle Predator there. It's pretty cool, other than the few hiccups I had with him. Alrighty. So we'll move on to the uh, City Hunter. Alright. Here's your City Hunter. City Hunter Predator. Hopefully I don't have... Oh, it looks like they fixed the issue with the uh, the gun this time. It's actually attached to him as is, so that's good. Well, the gun itself goes on here, but yeah. So that should be good. Well, thanks for helping. Oh, he came right out, which is nice. Alright, I can already say this one's cooler. I'm not sure if I like the color of the helmet. What I might do is switch out the, the head pieces. I don't know. We'll see. This is going to be hard. What you do, here's the trick. You take the hand back off. And you slide it through the hand while it's off. And then... the hand back on. Any case, there's the city hunter, hunter predator. Really cool figures, guys. Really cool figures. I thankfully didn't end up breaking this one. Although there's more tools and stuff I can get for them, I'll play around with that. Set these guys up in a bit, and we'll take a look at them when we're done. So there's a close-up of the uh, Predators posed. Got them nice and posed there. I think that's how I'm going to display them. I think they look pretty badass, guys. Pretty badass indeed. So there you have them, guys. Predators. We have the City Predator, City Hunter, Jungle Hunter. Awesome. I love them. Uh, like I said, I was kind of sad about this little piece here. 
breaking, but we'll we'll find a place and fix it. It'll be all good. But uh, th this is this is probably how I'm going to display them right here, and uh, yeah, I'm really stoked. So you guys can be looking to get these predators from NECA, or you could be looking into something else. Perhaps uh, there was a Godzilla at Target as well, but. Uh, I decided to go with these two instead of the Godzilla. It was a whole new one, and he looked like the original Godzilla. So it's really cool, but uh, I can't afford everything, you know. Uh, or are you guys just going to stick with Funko Pops? Six scale? Let me know in the comments down below. any case, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.